Hi Leo, welcome to Carol's Universe Tarot Readings from the Heart. Thanks ever so much for joining me on your week ahead reading. This is the 16th through to the 22nd of February 2020, which is uh, Sunday the 16th through to Monday. Sunday, sorry, the 16th through to Saturday the 22nd. Sorry, I probably look really stalled there, do apologise. Let's have a look then, Leo, at what the uh, cards are we're using this week, what decks we're using there. This Might Hurt Tarot by Isabella Rotman, one of my favourites, and also the Karen Kay Oracle of the Fairies as well, for your spiritual advice. Right, so I'm going to be doing a 20-card reading. I'm just putting down four rows of five cards, looking at each of the rows, rows, interpreting what I feel the universe is telling you this week, and also, you know, I'll just intuit and grab out whatever combinations I can see afterwards just to kind of give a final kind of round of what's happening. So, Universe Brew, what is the as advice that you have for Leo this week? What is the advice? What is the advice that you have for Aries? Um, not Aries, Leo. Sorry, Leo. What is the spiritual advice or what are the messages? Just tell me the messages that you have for Leo this week. What are the messages, please? 16th or 22nd of February, what are the messages? Let's have a look. So, we're going to put down the cards just putting them down and the readings just to let you now know are shorter uh, on YouTube now okay they're about 10 to 15 minutes um, if I because usually when I, I don't really have much time it's harder to put up a reading that's like an hour long so I guess a lot of people appreciate though the smaller readings but um usually the readings would be about 30 minutes but because I'm busy doing some other stuff um, yeah it's not possible to put up a longer reading this week but I really wanted something to make sure that something went out. Okay, so let's have a look then. So we've got our 20 cards down, like so. Right, let's have a look at what the energies are that the universe wants to let you know about. So judgment, okay. So this judgment for me is like final judgment, Leo. Right, it's where we have to make a final decision with the judgment energy. This is also about weighing up the pros and cons. It's also about facing your demons, you know, um, accountability, the judgment energy showing up here, okay? Uh, I'm seeing a transformation, new beginnings, because judgment is all about rebirth and a new beginning. So I'm seeing rebirth, new beginnings. So I'm seeing the ending of one phase and coming into another one for you, Leo, uh, coming in the next few weeks for Leo. Let's have a look at the next one showing up here. Uh, Ten of Coins, Cups Energy, final conclusion. So the conclusion showing here with the Ten of Cups. So it's the ending of the cycle. We've got a Ten of Cups, we've got a Judgment card. So there's definitely something about the ending of a cycle here. It's ending in a really good way as well. And uh, we've got a new beginning with the full energy showing here. Some of you guys also, I think, have made a very big life-changing decision to leave something behind. All right, so the fool is walking out of that 10. So some of you guys with judgment energy, the university is saying it's time to make that life-changing decision. It might be about leaving behind that 10. So it might be about ending a cycle or leaving your home or leaving something you've been in or a relationship, whatever it is. But I think that now is the time to really face up to the truth, to face up to what the universe is trying to uh, tell you about because this is all about awakening the soul. So now it's time to pay attention to... The voice of God in your ear with the judgment energy and some of you guys it's about time that you left something behind and close the chapter close the door uh, with that ten of cups energy I think as well because he's kind of saying goodbye to that ten of cups on there as well knight of wands it's time to take action all right uh, you got a knight of wands energy here so after that closure card of the ten it's time now to focus on action here is well leo with this knight of wands energy uh it may take a little bit of time before your dreams come to fruition but they will all right you need to have a bit of patience though however with this energy here so let's do the first row again what i feel it's telling you leo the message is this week that we have the ending of one cycle and the beginning of another with the full uh with the full the ten of cups and the judgment card some of you guys really have to focus on making a very important decision it might be about letting go of a situation here ending the cycle closing the door and entering into a new life because he's entering also into a new life with the judgment energy showing here all right uh the universe is telling you to focus on taking action with that knight of wands energy all right but it may be that things take a bit of time to come together with the temperance energy but you've just got to stick in there because it will happen 
Uh, what's the next line telling you? The next line is telling you, Leo, that's you, the King of Wands. It's time to take charge with the King of Wands energy, uh, possibly of your money situation with the Nine of Coins. The Nine of Coins is all about your personal finances, your job, your financial security. So it's time to take charge of your financial security, I think, with the Nine of Coins this week as well. Um, I feel also, though, with the King of Wands energy, that if you take charge... Uh, with the King of Wands energy. Uh, it might be something to do with attaining money with that Nine of Coins energy. We've got the world energy talking about something that's being accomplished, hitting a goal, all right, with the Nine of Coins energy. It may be that you're achieving a goal in terms of financial attainment with the Nine, because the Nine of Coins is all about financial security, okay? So this is about attaining more money and achieving a goal with the world energy. All right, so it's time for you to take charge with the King of Wands energy, all right? Because I feel that some of you guys are focused on attaining financial security here, and this can be accomplished, I feel, with the world. This goal can be met with the world energy showing up here as well. Uh, the Nine of Coins is also about property matters or a flat or a home, um, which is interesting here. Let's have a look at the rest of this spread. Knight of Coins, work, services. So work and the Eight of Sword, Knight of Coins, slow movement, Knight of Coins is work and the Eight of Swords, confusion concerning work. So some of you guys taking charge, earning your own money. Okay. So I feel that for some of you guys as well, Leo, um, I feel that if you have been confused or if you're feeling irritated or frustrated with that Eight of Swords about the mundanity of your work, it's time to take charge. It's time to take charge. Uh, I think that some of you guys could probably earn a lot of money working from home with that world and the Nine of Coins, because the Nine of Coins is working from home. You're earning a great deal of money, all right? You're earning a great deal of money, and it could be working on the internet from home, for example. Okay, because the world can be like the World Wide Web and this is earning an income. So some of you guys could earn an income working over the internet. So you might be working, for example, running an eBay business or, you know, a Facebook business or something like that and earning money from home, from the world. Earning money from home, nine of coins, from the world. Using the world, so using the resources. And you'll see here as well, can you see? Look at the resources that are being handed to you and look how you're in a place of safety. So if we looked here and said that Leo was the world, was the lady in the world, can you see all the resources that are available to you here? And that's how you earn your money. All right. So I feel that uh, for some of you guys as well, Leo, we do this again. But if you're getting tired and frustrated about having to do a nine to five job with that Niger Coins energy, then this is all about King of Wands Leo taking charge of this. All right, you really need to be focusing on all of the resources that are, could be available to you right from the comfort of your own home. You could be earning money from home. You could be working from home, earning money that way. Um, the next one here, the sun. So new beginnings, optimism, positivity showing here. Uh, I feel that you guys need to have the confidence so you need to be confident enough to start probably your own business because the Page of Coins is a startup business, all right? So Leo needs to be confident enough, Page of Coins. It could be to start your own business, but also to put the time into learning with that Page of Coins energy. Five of Cups energy showing here, feeling sad, lost. Queen of Overwhelming Sadness showing up here will be rectified with the Justice energy showing here, will be healed and rectified. I feel if you guys could just focus, if you could just get really excited about the potential, especially if it's a business thing, Leo, if you could get really excited with the sun energy about the potential, the potential perhaps of what, you know, earning your own money, running your own business could do. Possibly, you know, it's an internet business. You know, you need to look from, the, you know, you're in a safe space here. So you have all of these opportunities that could be provided to you from this safe space of the home. You could be earning a lot of money online. I see you guys earning money online from home, okay? But I feel that in order to do that, you have to get really excited about it, all right? Because I do feel that some of you guys have been feeling really depressed with this Five of Cups energy. 
in fact overwhelmingly so with that queen of cups energy but this energy can be rectified with the justice energy showing here okay if only you could think confidently about what you'll get if you put the work in because the page of coins has a dream all right so this is all about somebody who has a desire so you need to look optimistically and start getting confident all right this is all about the power of attraction all right visualize where it is that you want to be with that page of coins energy and start getting confident about it because some of you guys have been feeling a really overwhelming sense of depression okay concerning the mundanity of the jobs that you do some of you guys really frustrated by the mundanity of the job it's the same old same old knight of coins energy so if you're feeling this way leo start taking charge of your life all right you could be earning money from home using the world's resources which is the internet all right start getting confident about the money that you can make all right if you start doing that this sadness and overwhelming depression some of you guys have felt especially about the work that you do could be rectified with that justice energy showing there so it's the time to get really positive about this and the potential especially the potential of running businesses online there's a lot of potential in that finally the page of wands energy all right i feel that you need to go out there and you need to promote your services because the page of wands is promoting via his voice so promoting things online the services of the knight of cups promote your gifts so the Knight of Cups in terms of services is the gift that you hold. So you need to start getting out there, Leo, and promoting the gifts that you hold. Okay, start promoting your gifts online, wherever, YouTube, wherever it is. All right. Three of Coins energy. People are going to watch what you do. People will be watching you with that Three of Coins energy. Dreams will come to fruition as well. Hard work is going to pay off with that Star energy as well. So the hard work of the Three of Coins is going to pay off with the Star energy showing here eight of cups finally allowing you to pursue other things other dreams all right this is your life's purpose as well the journey that you're on is where you're meant to be this is your life's purpose this is where you're meant to be finally on the right track what i feel that the reading is saying this week uh leo for you guys the advice from the universe is this Let's get these cards together where they're meant to be. Um, firstly, uh, some of you guys, I feel you need to make uh, a very big decision. All right. I feel that uh, this week and in the further coming weeks, uh, this is all about rebirth, transformation, new beginnings and closing a door on what no longer works for you. All right. Now, you need to start taking action. Things may take time but they'll work out in the end. Take charge, because some of you guys are really tired of the mundanity of doing the same old, same old thing in terms of work. So you need to start taking charge of your own destiny with that King of Wands energy. Now, the way that you can do that, possibly some of you guys, you can earn a very good living working online. Look at the world, it holds many resources. And you can do all of this from the comfort of your own home. So some of you guys want to be focusing on working online. You can earn a lot of money that way. All right. Uh, I feel that if you guys are really frustrated by the monotony of your job, and if you've been feeling this overwhelming depression and sadness, like this is all there is, the universe is asking you to get really quite enthusiastic and excited about the potential of running your own business from home. Because you've got a lot of resources the internet offers a lot of resources here, all right? And you can earn a lot of money that way from home, but you need to start getting excited about the potential of it. Go out there and promote your gifts, all right? Because your hard work will pay off with the star, all right? And it could put you on a journey, a new journey, where you're discovering new things. Also, it could help you to discover exactly what your purpose is in life. Brilliant, brilliant reading. Let's have a look at what the advice is for the week on that, Leo. What's the advice for Leo on this reading for the week? What's the advice for Leo? Show me. Uh, the advice is music. It says, listen carefully for there may be a message in the music you hear. Music can lift your soul, rekindle memories and charm fairies to your door. Wow. 
Okay, that's your reading for the week, Leo. I'd like to say thanks ever so much for joining me on Carol's Universe. If you'd like your own private reading, click on the link in the comment section or in the end screen. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.